Hey, it's Style 345 back here with another video. I really need to work on a different intro now. Anywho, so I did a TikTok showing you how to use your phone as your actual webcam instead of buying a webcam or using an expensive ass DSLR. So in this video, I'm going to take you through the full tutorial and don't blink because I'm going to make this as quick as possible because I hate really long tutorial videos. Just get to the point. Okay, so first thing you want to do is open up your app store, whether it be Android or iOS, and you want to type in Epoch Cam. So after you type in Epoch Cam, so you're going to see two different ones. The bottom at the bottom is the free 720p version, which is still good because most people who are watching streams are either doing it on their phone or a tablet anyway. So it's not that bad. But if you want the full 1080p paid version, it's only $8, and this will give you all the features that comes custom with the app. Once you decide which version of the app that you want to download, then you want to head over to Elgato.com and go to cameras and then click on the Epoch cam. So this is what the homepage looks like. As you can see here, somebody already got a phone set up on a tripod. But what we want to do is we want to go ahead and scroll down until we find the device drivers. And if you got a Mac, choose Mac. And if you got a Windows, choose Windows. I'm gonna choose Windows because that's what I'm using right now. And then you wanna go to select your product and you wanna type in, I'm mean, gonna click on Epoch Cam. And then select your system. And then once you click that, you wanna go ahead and click download. Um, I already got this installed, so I'm not gonna walk you through the installation, but it's pretty straightforward. So after you get the device drivers installed on your computer, then you want to go to your mobile phone, open up your Epoch Cam, and then you also want to go onto your desktop and open up your Epoch Cam on there also. And this is what the screen will look like, but I have mine connected via Wi-Fi, so mine is going to automatically connect. So this is what yours should look like on your mobile device. So if you go over here to the settings, you can see you have quality settings. You can use Wi-Fi, USB. So now that we got all that set up and made sure that our cam works, we want to import it over to OBS so we can start streaming. So right now I got a new scene set up just for this. So this is pretty much how it'll look. Right now you want to click on add source and then you want to go to video capture device. Then click on add source and then you want to go over here to your devices drop down and then select your epoch camera it should pull it right in there and then you can set all your settings how you want but i'm going to go ahead and click done and then as you can see got my webcam right here and if you notice depending on how i want to set my camera you see it automatically flips orientations so if you want to go horizontal or vertically it doesn't matter it'll automatically flip it just like you're using your actual phone and there it is it's just that simple if you have any other quick tutorials that you want me to make, maybe you don't know how to set up a scene, maybe you don't know how to set up your actual like widgets and stuff, just let me know. Comment down below, I'll make a quick video. I hate watching long tutorial videos, that shit makes my head hurt. But you know, that 3 for 5 make sure to like and subscribe, share this with your friends, maybe they need to know this, and yeah, check out my other videos. See you guys in the next video, peace.